Hi, Leslie. You were asking about how to um, ungroup messages in your email using uh, LinkedIn. Uh, sorry, on uh, Gmail. If you click on the uh, wheel here, you get to settings. You'll get to this image under general. It's somewhere in here. Um, conversation view from on, it's probably on, you want to change it to off. And that's where you do it. Okay, so in addition to this, um, after you've, you've set it up in your settings, you still need to, if you are using the Gmail app, it will overwrite that settings because in the Gmail app, if you go to your settings, you scroll all the way down, it's gonna start there. It's gonna look like this. You scroll all the way down to settings and general. Right here, you get um, conversation view. Group emails in the same conversation for IMAP, POP3, and Exchange account. You want to remove this and save it. You have no idea how many times. I have accidentally deleted a whole bunch of emails because they were grouped. Um, you know, you look at your emails like this, you just swipe left to delete, swipe left, swipe left, it's very fast. Um, but sometimes you don't realize if they're linked to other messages, it will delete the whole group. And I've tried to um, recuperate emails that I've deleted that way and I wasn't able to from my trash folder. So. Um, it's very important if you want to ungroup the messages that you undo it here in the um, in the settings. Um, the reason why I recommend using the Gmail app over any other um, email app, which you can, you can use any email app to access your Gmail or uh, your Google for Works by allowing the IMAP or POP. Um, the biggest advantage with this app is it filters your updates promotions and socials. So any emails that are viewed as promotional will go in this folder and it keeps them nice and tidy. Updates, all the social media, um, emails from LinkedIn, Twitter would all go into, um, into that folder. So it keeps the main inbox a little bit um, tidier.